We'll see how loud that uh, stuff in the background is, but there we go. Let's see if it kicks on and tells me what I'm doing here. Let's go in the shop and shop. There we go. Back it up a little bit. Throw back this whole thing up a little bit. There we go. I've turned the opposite way of what I think. And we want this kind of to be this, this way. There we go. Wow. Bling blow. Nice lighting. We're doing the thing. Gotta wait for my go live notification to do its thing. And then we'll we'll do our thing. We will do do with our thing. Here I am, here I am. Oh yeah, we'll we'll put the camera with me today. There we go. Let's, let's turn it maybe off the light and we'll come over here. There we go. We'll wait for a second and we'll get cooking. Alright. So today's dish is going to be uh, steak with some pasta. I'm using them thickly. I like them. They're a little bit thicker, nicer. We're going to add that into some mushrooms. A little butter garlic sauce. That's what we're going to make today. So, if you're into that, you're into that. There we go. Now this is maybe a little better. I got the sun above me. Oh! Alright. Should probably turn it off that maybe? Maybe this is a better angle. Alright. So let's do this. We got our steak. We got our mushrooms. We got our dumpling noodles. We got my favorite ingredient. Butter. Alright, so what we're going to do now is we're going to start with going to wash my hands because it's salty. There we go. Give it a nice wash. Steak and pasta. There we go. Hell yeah. It was the actual correct thing today. Let's go. Pro streamer. Pro streamer mode. Pro motherfucking streamer mode, baby. But yeah, that's, that's that's what we're doing. We are cooking today. That's that's indeed what we're doing. Chefing it up. Chefing it freaking up. Alright. How are we get to doing this? Because I'm hungry and I want to eat. So we're going to throw the noodles to the side. We're throwing mushrooms to the side. We're gonna, uh, yeah, do the thing. 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 Move this over here. Do some ASMR for the bags. And then, yeah, we're gonna cut this stuff up. I feel like I'm forcing people down when I do this. Like, hey, man, uh, put your put your stuff down here. Put your stuff down here. There, wash my hands. Rinse my hands off one more time. OCD kind of. Okay. All right. So what we're gonna do first is gonna get a knife. Wait, big old boy. And we're gonna start to uh go to work. I'm gonna roll up my sleeves here. Gotta get sleeves rolled up. Let's get our steak. Gonna desecrate this cutting board just for this. And we've got our broccoli from the other day when we made other food on it. So we got a little, we got a little free broccoli with our order today. Everybody does. I'm going to move my bag out the way here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to make this into very thinner, very thinner pieces. Because I don't want it super thin today, or super thick today. There we go. There we go. Nice little thin pieces like that. This is what I'm going to try to achieve here. Here we go. Another nice little thin piece. Another nice little thin piece. I'm going to do this pretty well through a lot of this. So Here we go again. Nice little thin pieces. And I might be able to go thinner if I wanted. There we go. Very, very thinly sliced this is what we want. And we're going to try to, that to me is worse. I don't want to do that. Make a nice, 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 nice thin slices. This is going to, what's going to go in there. Cut this little thin piece at the bottom off. 
it doesn't really matter how it goes in as long as we're getting a cut. I probably should do it a different way. This way seems a little crazy. Actually, here's what we're gonna do. Let's have it, and then we're gonna then we can cube it up a little bit easier. There we go. Which is nice and thin. A little bit thicker than what I would get at the store, but hey, saves me a little bit of money. Saves me a little bit of money, I'm down. And we'll do the last little bit here. Those little pieces like this. Almost like fajita strips, but not quite like fajita strips. But yeah, kind of a similar thing. We'll go, we'll just go against the grain on this one. We'll do it this way. It'll look kind of funky. It's all right, though. So since I'm only really cooking for two people tonight, this should be plenty enough for what I need. For my purposes. Plenty, plenty, plenty enough. Let's go ahead and top off this part. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now we've got various sizes of steak. And I kind of want them all about the same ish size. I'm going to come through here and kind of take some things down a little bit as I kind of see fit for uniformity purposes and cooking uniformity purposes, even though this stuff will probably cook relatively quick. So realistically, it's some of these bigger ones that I want to break down. There we go. That's probably good enough. That's probably good enough. There we go. A couple little smaller pieces here. Break them down just a little bit more. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's cut this down a little bit. Butcher block style, you know. Here we go, here we go. There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Here we go, here we go. All about uniformish, uniformish pieces now. We'll go ahead and turn our skillet on. I'm gonna wash my hands quick. There we go, hands are washed. I'm gonna go ahead and dry them off here. We'll get our skillet going. A little low, very low. Because what we're gonna do is we are going to we won't probably need this out the long. Save that for another day. Save it for another rainy day. Let's see here. Let's see here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good old surface. I can't even get the uh, thing to do its thing. But yeah, here we go. All right. So, getting the cast iron skillet hot. We're going to take this butter off here for now. 
We're going to move the camera a little bit closer so we can see the skillet. We're going to move the... There we go. Now you can see it perfectly. Get rid of my trash real quick. While we kind of wait. Risking the brisket right there. All right. Yeah. So. We're just waiting on this to kind of warm up now. We're going to give it a little bit of a... Give a little oil. Yo, Circle, you know it is. You know it is, Strats. You know it's Dab O'Clock, baby. You know it's Dab O'Clock. It's always Dab O'Clock somewhere, right? Here, I'll... Since I just washed my hands, I'll go grab the steamroller. We can take a, we can take a rip, Ski. Hold on. I got, us a, I got us a fat daddy bowl. Yo, Sarah, what's up? Danny. Oh, yeah. We go. We always going for the beef. We always going for the beef. I already got it actually chopped up. We're actually about to go in on some uh, pretty, pretty bowl life, you know. Let's get her in here. Ta-da. You know, beautiful, beautiful sift on top. Nice blonde color. Nice blonde color sift. And that's what we're going to go in on. So, big cheers. Sarah, I see you. Much love. Glad you're not default dancing on me yet. I appreciate you. What's going on, Danny? How are you? How are you? Strats, let's uh, let's go in. Let's go in, buddy. Cheers. Cheers to you. Here we go. Our pan's smoking. Oh no, help! Our pan is smoking! Help! Sheesh! It's a little smoky, ain't it? A little smoky pan. I'll have to go back and clip that one. That was pretty cool. <coughs> I do say so myself. Uh, but yeah. Let's, let's uh, make it back, go back over here. But how are y'all doing, yeah? How's everything going? You know, anything anything new today? Anything exciting? Uh, I biked like 20 miles, my usual. Did some work. Then I uh, got about, oh yeah, I did some other stuff. I started about um, 30 onion starts. Um, and I started about 15 garlic starts. I'll, I'll, I'll Maybe after this, I'll take y'all out to the garden. And we'll, we'll, I'll show you what's going on. And I got some carrots coming through that I planted on a whim uh, when it was still cold. And I think they're also coming through, so. We've got a bunch of exciting stuff. Like, I was trying to figure out why this perfect row of, like, something was growing. And I was like, I think I planted that. You know. Went out there and checked uh, something. I was trying to dig up my strawberries. Pretty neat. <laughs> so, always I start on low. I always start on low. And then we're going to, I always start with my favorite thing. A different kind of fat because I like multiple kinds of fats. So we're gonna go with the X3, 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 X3 virgin. Only want them green, green, green. They're them like green berry green olives. Coat the pan with a little bit. I love the smell of olive oil. I don't know if y'all have heard me say that before, but I've probably said it every time I turn on the stream and I use olive oil. I love this shit. It smells so good. What I could probably do is get the small pot, and I could probably start cooking the uh, the noodles as well. So I'm gonna grab a pot. I'm gonna grab some water. Y'all come with me, so we don't just watch a skillet. Here you go. I can y'all can see my backside if y'all like. There it is. Go over here to the uh, over here to the thing. Grab some water. I ain't measuring this shit. Who measures water when they're cooking pasta? I know I don't. Pasta water, boom. 
You came as a Kirby stream? I appreciate you, Sarah. I appreciate you being here. And default dancing on me. I appreciate that. But yeah, we got the water. Put the water down right beside it. Because I want to try to do two things at once. Because I'm, com I'm a combo master. Combo, combo, combo. Look at me go. Two things at once. So I'm going to turn this back burner on. And it's different. So I'm going to turn on medium. So it doesn't start boiling immediately. Because this shit gets fast hot. So... But yeah, I appreciate y'all being here. I appreciate y'all being here. Actually, I, I was looking at chat for a second there, and uh, well, I was looking at who was in chat, and I was like, okay, so there's gonna be some people lurking today. I was like, I'm down with that. I like lurkers. I always, I always, no matter if it's one person here or there would be an infinite number of person here, I would be the same person either way. Uh, as somebody said the other day, I am weed on legs. So you know what I mean? That's what I am. It's who I am. It's who, who I'll always be. But it's okay. I don't mind it. I'm a hyper intelligent person and it feels good, man. You know, so now this is nice and a little warm. We're going to go ahead and beep. off into the thing. There we go. I'm going to break this off real quick. Then I like letting you guys sit around. Then we put some soap. And I at least want to rinse it off and then I'll wash it here. In a momento. There we go. So now we're gonna wash in a minute. Dab sweat? Hell yeah, dude. I'm right now. I'm I'm a uh, that that sip that just smoked was put me out of my mind, man. But we're gonna keep it going. I will not let it fall for me. I will not let it make me a sleepy, tired man. I will just keep pushing on. And you can see how fast this meat's gonna brown. So this isn't gonna take no time for this to cook. And so I'm gonna go ahead and actually just let it turn it up. So we're gonna, this meat will be seared in like zero flat. So we'll go ahead and get the sear going. And then I'll, uh, we'll pitch it, we might as well pitch in our mushrooms because they're gonna sweat and actually give this moisture. So once this gets a little brown, we'll pitch in our mushrooms. And then, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll pitch in our butter after that. The t-shirt I'm wearing? The t-shirt I'm wearing is from a band called Hound Mouth. It's a pretty sick shirt actually. I like this shirt. Hold on, let me get the let me get the light light view on it. I got some lucky roommates. Yeah, you know. Kiki is gonna be here today, so it's just me and Anna. So, just me and Anna. Just me and Anna Banana. But yeah, this is Hound Mouth. This is a band that we saw. Looks sick. Alien. He's drinking a beer, getting wasted in the desert. And then the uh, the back is. Let's do this. Yeah, the band called Hound Mouth. They got they, they have some pretty cool shirts. They're out of actually they're actually out of our out of state, so they're out of Indiana, which is cool. There we go. And you can see kind of this is already starting to brown, like I said. And I turn the heat up a little bit more so it brown probably a little faster. Beef fat's in there with a little bit of olive oil. But yeah, I, I had to use this. I had to use the steak again. So that's why we're having steak, you know, like bougie people multiple times, you know. I guess I could have just made this mushroom and garlic sauce, but we got it. We're gonna use it, you know. We got it. We're going to use it. Like I always say, I, I cook to what I have. I cook to what I have. No, 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 no. I see that. Pineapple pizza. Uh, where's the, Where's Lucas when I need him to talk about a... Uh, uh, what, is, what is it? I forget how he phrases it. Pizza Hawaii. Yes. I like it. I like, I like the way that that's phrased. Pizza Hawaii. I like that. Cause that's 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 what it is. We're not gonna we're not gonna lie or make it make a, a fake assumptions here. And that's what it is. That is what it is. But yes, I I I, I have made beef the past couple times. Past couple three times actually. I've been eating a lot of beef recently. Should probably stop that, huh? But you know, I got I got to keep doing things. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, you gotta test them. You gotta test what they are. That pineapple pizza is an atrocity to life. 
But I'm going to go ahead and actually, something I forgot to do. Get a little salty, salty. Not too much. Just a little bit. And then I got to salt the uh, pasta water. There we go. Ma, oh yeah, love mom. Hell yeah, I see that. What is that other one? A hamburger or something? What the fuck is this one? Laundry basket. Oh. Because people aren't doing their fucking laundry or something? Here we go. I probably won't eat it as much beef tonight because my stomach's actually been hurting. So I'll probably just eat mostly pasta, garlic, and mushrooms myself. Probably just eat that because I haven't been feeling good. So, you know, I'm going to give my stomach a little break. I'm probably going to eat pasta and garlic. Or just pasta. Yeah. Well, I guess my stomach hasn't been feeling good. Yeah, one's like a, what is that one? Oh, uh, oh, shh. It's a shh. It's the hut. Let's keep it on the hush, baby. All right. What kind of pasta? We're going to be using these dumpling egg noodles. I've never really cooked them before. They look really good. They're kind of a wider. Yeah. Here, I'll pull one out and show you. They're like a they're like a kind of a more of a wider wider pasta. Correct. There, there you go, Artic. Correct. Yes. One hundred percent. You gotta you just gotta make sure you don't boil they they uh they're a quick boil, so you just you just boil them real fast and they're done. You just boil them real fast and you're done. Okay, you don't have to do a whole lot to them. So what I'm gonna do is mine'll mine'll go in once this is boiled, and we will uh we'll let it we'll let it do the thing, you know. So we just, I just gotta get this to boil first. Which I could put a lid on it and make it go faster. I'm just I'm just not, you know, I'm just not. Just kinda Taking my taking my time, enjoying the uh, enjoying the cooking. So now it's got a little color to it. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of beef broth just to give them a little bit more hydration. There you go. We're gonna let this cook out. There we go. Add make the beef even take taste beefier. Why the hell not, right? There we go. There we go. There we go. But they're not too crazy. They're not. They're not too crazy trickier. They're just. They're just a little bit different. You just have to boil them really fast. Uh, let's just use this bowl. I'll use this bowl to pull the the sh the shmeat out. But yeah, these I like these. I like the thicker dumpling egg noodles. These things are always a lot. I don't know. I just like them. They're a little bit thicker than your. Typical just egg egg noodles. Um, they have a little bit more surface. Uh, so in this case, where this is going to end up being, have it. Yeah, OG's my roommate. Yep, correct. He is indeed my roommate. You didn't know that? You did not know that, good sir? Yes, sir. Mr. OG Cake Beater is my roommate. Um, we've been roommates for, I don't know, what, a year and a half, two years, something like that. Yeah. I think since my was like a maybe a seven month or eight month sub in TBL, yeah. Maybe even earlier. Yeah, Shmi. Oh yeah, Sarah. Which, like I said, I'm probably gonna go light on the Shmi tonight myself, cause, man, stomach, man. Stomach. Stomach hasn't been nice to me. I think I ate too much cheese yesterday. Also, my body was like, bruh, you don't do that much dairy. Who are you? Person that called me weed on legs the other day was calling me, I think, I think they were calling me a tard too. Which, you know, whatever. I can take the, I can take a little mental abuse, you know. It's okay, I like it. It's good for the soul. Um... 
But uh, yeah. It happens. It happens. It would be like that. Unless I need to just turn way down now. Because what I'm going to do now. Take this little bit of beef in here. Take some. Here we go. That stuff's out of there. Use a little bit. No such thing as too much cheese. You're correct, man. But for me, it, it's a little bit, man. It's a little bit. There's, there's such a thing as too much cheese for me. Personally, there is. For y'all, nah. Yeah. I just my my little my little dumb stomach just can't handle it. What I'm gonna do here is now, I'm gonna flip butter onto this thing, I guess. All right, I'm gonna milk a little butter here. No, this is. What's up, skills? How's it going, baby? What's up, dude? How are you? Good to see you on. Good to see you on. I might not have made enough water here. I might have to make a little bit more water. That's okay if that's the case. Yes, yeah, kiss it up, kiss it up. What's going on, man? Good to see you. We're just, uh, you know, feeding, feeding Anna, feeding I. Mr. Uh, o Mr. OG Cake, he went away today, so. He took, he stepped out, you know, stepped out on us like a stepdad does, you know. So we're melting this butter into the pan with a little bit of the the beef stock. It's gonna make us a nice little a nice little sum, you know what I mean? Nice little sum. While I'm doing that, I guess I can go over here. Wash some of these mushrooms. I'm gonna start to let them soak up this stuff. Cook in here. Cook in here. Just vibing. Oh, damn, dude. Oh, because he didn't invite you to play games? I feel that, man. I bet that's what it is. He just didn't even say anything. He just went with, with a three squad, and he didn't say nothing, man. He's elite. Or what else did he do? Uh, well, I guess there's there could be many reasons. There could be many reasons. What's the reason? You don't have to tell me here if you don't want to. But yes. I feel you. Alright. Put him on blast, huh? He said, I'm putting you on full on blast. Full on blast, sir. But hell yeah, I appreciate you, dog. Appreciate you. He is dead to you until further notice. What the fuck did he do? I'm just that's what I'm trying to figure out here. We might need more mushrooms though, because this shit's gonna break down so fast. It's gonna be like it's gonna be like two mushrooms once we're done, and it'll be like, I want more, and I'll be like, Yeah, I know. So We'll just go ahead and make. We'll just go ahead and make the most ninety nine percent of them. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Sarah's over there confused now. She's like, "What?" You know, these will break down pretty quickly, but I don't really want them to break down super fast. I just want them kind of to absorb everything. So I'm just kind of getting everything tossed and coated. Tossed and coated. It's good old shroomies. Good old shroomy shrooms. Shroom, shroom, shroom. Hell yeah, hell yeah. I'm also just vibing. 6.04 p.m. Where's my water at? I do need to drink some water, man. I'm, st I'm stoned like a fucking rock quarry. You know? That's me right now. I don't even know how, how I came up with that. But I'm here. I'm cooking, doing my thing, you know, it's the 15th day, I think, might be more, I just kind of rough estimated it one day, because I kind of, I kind of did day nine, I think three times, um, so, I don't know what happened, man, I just kind of fucking, we did it, we did the fucking thing, you know,
and we'll see how well how much these cook down so we'll turn it up just a little bit more get them to the get them to eat that butter pasta still doing its thing good old fragrant good old fragrant these here we're gonna hit them with a little bit of salt um i don't know what should i make tomorrow i think i'm gonna make something did i clip clip the weed on legs you bet your ass i did let me see if i can get it from my mobile because if i do it on my uh my surface my fucking computer will freak out uh let's see clips Oh yeah, it's my top clip right now. Yeah, let's see if I can post it. That is, thank you for that. Thank you for that. Well, let's see if I can. Let's see if I can get it right here. Boom. Where is it at? I can't. Um, I can't get it. Just if you go to the top clip. No, I do not know that person. I have no idea who they are. I've never seen them in my life. And this is getting the mushroom juice cooked out into this too. So this is gonna have a little mushroom element too. To our, to our butter and whatnot. And what I might do is, I think I might sear these on the side. And no, hell no, I didn't know that person. I had no idea who they were. And these were a person that showed up in chat. They were a first time chatter. You know, it's like that sometimes, you know? People pick up the or big, people pick up the vibe real fast. And that's okay. That's really okay that they do that. You can pick up the vibe that fast. If you think I'm weed on legs, well, I may indeed be weed on legs, you know? That's just me. It's just a part of who I am. Part of my persona now. I'm just a part of, you know, I'm just weed on literal legs. But yes, I 100% I clipped it. I clipped it because I guess people, that's what people see me as, you know. What up, Webbit? A snack on legs? Hell yeah. Sarah does. Sarah does. A whole damn snack. Oh. Oh. One with uh, that wish to... It wasn't spring and it is spring at the same time. Yeah, it is, dude. That it really is. They just were like, bro, you look like weed on legs. I'm like, what? I'm like, what? What did you say? What did you say to me, mama? <laughs> I mean, it's true, but. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Remember when I said allergies? Oh, they fucking fuck my butt, man. Oh. Alright. Am I gonna do it to me again? One more time? Oh, no. Nope. <laughs> got me. Got me. Got me. Got me. Oh, God. There we go. Woo! Woo! Alright. Oh. Oh man, I gotta keep taking care of the hands because I keep sneezing on them. Yeah, take care of them kids, man. Enjoy your dinner, man. Peace out. Always love seeing you, Strats. Always love seeing you, man. Big cheers. Glad you were able to come in and we could rip a rip a rip ski with me. Big cheers, dude. Oh, my nose. Help! My nose! Hawk the doggo! Later, Strats. Good evening, Strats. See you later, Strats. Enjoy. Have have a fun time with your kids, Strats. Post whatever you're making in a uh, uh, whatever uh, whatever Discord we mutually share a uh, food channel so I can see what you're making. You already get to see what I'm making. Hi, Leanne. What's going on? Good to see you in here. Much love. Cheers. My eyes just, you know, ah, bugging right now. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Come on over there. I actually was posting food pics today. I was just kind of photo dumping food pics, actually, from the last couple days and streams and things. So I'll, I'll be doing that again. So, yeah, hop on in. Yeah, come on over. Always love new people to hang out with. I do post a lot in there. I post a lot in the 420 channel too. So those are my two favorite channels. 
Um, I also do play games. Just I'm I'm not right now. I have to, I I play them at night sometimes. But most of the time, if I do play games, it's Super Animal Royale, or I'll play like weird, just trash games like that. Like, no one really wants to watch, but I'm gonna play them anyway. What's up, man? I didn't even know you were still here. Yeah. Nice. Thing in there. Do we? Yeah. yeah. Why? Let's know if she can have it. Huh? Let's know if she can have it. Uh, tell her hell no. Yeah, she can have it. Okay. I have fancy sour cream. Well, I mean, I don't, you don't even have to take that one. I mean, which one of her? I was actually like fancy sour cream. See if it works. Huh? See if it works. Just open it too, because it makes sure it looks. I mean, it's sour cream. I don't think. I don't know how sour cream goes bad, but I think we only use like. It's so good. I was like, we barely used any of it. I think. Yeah. Because I used it for one thing. I think. You joined? Hell yeah, Sarah. Appreciate you. Thanks for coming by. Mr. Uh, Mr. Cake and uh, OG Nico Polo are also there. They're kind of like a shared Discord. I don't really like feel like managing my own because it seems like a, a whole thing. So I'm just not going to do that. But I will hang I will hang out and chat and chill. Uh, I talk to people from all over the world. It's cool to see people from all over the world, you know, like wherever, the, wherever we all are, you know. We all kind of share the same passion for things. Everybody likes to eat. Uh, everybody likes dopamine. So, you know. Actually, can't really like, there you go. It's maybe a better angle. I love mushrooms also. That's why I made more. Because I was like, this ain't going to cut it, man. This, is not, this ain't going to cut it in terms of mushrooms. I'm actually going to turn them down now because I've got a nice kind of mushroomy, buttery, beefy kind of kind of thing going on at the bottom here if you see it. It's kind of it's kind of nice. It's kind of nice. We're going to add a little bit more uh, beef stock to it to, uh, you know, not let all that go away, all that tastiness go away. So... There we go. And you can kind of see the fat in it too. Like, it's beautiful. I love seeing that. Here, let me see if I can get y'all a close up of this. Because it's kind of pretty. I like this. I like seeing this. You know, food. Can y'all see the, the fat layer there? That fat kind of where those bubbles are. You can see the fat kind of staying on top of it. I love seeing that in food. I don't know why. Because that's the butter right there. Yeah, that's the stuff you want. Yep. That's the, that's, the, that's the stuff you do want. And we're gonna add we're gonna add and we're gonna add just a little bit more of the uh you know the good stuff to it because we got stuff. So enjoy that. And this is what we're gonna toss our pasta in. What? Smells delicious? Hell yeah. Appreciate that. You know it's gonna be delicious. Well, now we're just looking at the hallway. Uh, yeah, don't mind, don't mind my hallway. You can see my light on from my office over there, too. Yeah, no big deal. But yeah, let's get this butter melted in here. Yes, delicious, delicious, delicious. And then now I'm going to check my pasta back here. It's about that time. Yo. I think we're pretty well there. Let me make sure. Let me take one out of here like a madman. I was just testing it this way. I don't know why. This is probably the craziest way to do it. Okay. These are to the point where they're like, they've got a little bit of texture to them, y'all. A little chewy still. You always do that too? I figure that's the way most people do it. You just take one out. Nobody's sitting there doing the thing where you're like, oh, let me let me push it against the side here. Shit's gonna just slip away every time. It's gonna piss you off. Why? What? what? Just pull one out and burn your hand. You know, like the, one of the cooks I watched, Josh Weissman, he says you're gonna get asbestos hands cooking. You know, you, you won't even feel heat. like I sometimes turn my heat on and or like my water on and it's scalding and I'm like, oh shit, it's actually burning my hands. Well, better turn it off. You know, it's not, not even like a ow. It's like a. <laughs> Some fun, you know that like the dog that's drinking the coffee. They're like, "This is fine." That's me with hot water.
Also, Wabbit, uh, oh yeah, I got the, I, I, I always turn the heat on, sheesh, you know, I got, I gotta, I gotta let them know, know I'm here, you know, still. Here, while this is doing this, we can kind of, we'll say hi to me. Move out the way, little thingy. Here. Hello, hi, it's me. This is at a normal level. Hi, it's me. What's going on? Curve dog coming at you. Da -na 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 -na. You know. Let's see if we're here. now. Now we're now we're eye to eye with each other. What do you want to say to me? What do you got to say, huh? I'm gonna go cross-eyed looking at this freaking thing. Back on the food. It ain't about me. It's about this food. This is the food doggy dog chain. Well, no, 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 don't say that, Kirby. No, 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 no. Sure. We're gonna go backwards from what I just said. It's not about anything about to do with dogs. Nothing to do with dogs here. Just super animals that may get killed every once in a while. Yeah. And now with these egg noodles, I'm gonna drain, I'm gonna get the strainer now. Ugh. Turn this on super low. Oh, where's my strainer? My cotton bag? Things in here. Yeah, I might be looking at Oh, good. I have, I'm glad I have a camera right behind me, man. Y'all just, y'all just seen, uh, y'all just seen butt crack. Y'all just seen butt crack. That's okay. I did the damn thing. I did the damn thing. Uh, where is the, uh, no, no colander, but so we're going to do this old school way. Grab it with hand. Turn this off. Like I said, as best as hand, this shit's hot. We just poured a little bit of water on the floor, but that's okay. My hand was getting hot, so I had to transfer it. So we're just old school way. Boom. I do not want really any of this starchy water. I'm going to try to pour all the starch out. I'm actually going to rinse them real quick. I do not really want the starch. So I rinse them out. And now I'm going to add these to this to finish off. You're, you're playing sour? Hell yeah. Fuck yeah. So we're going to add these noodles to the, the, the mushroomy, garlicky, buttery goodness. Make sure I'm not taking a lot of water with them because we don't really want the water. And this will finish off in this, this sauce. And I'm going to leave it like this because I'm probably going to eat it as it is. I'm not gonna, probably going to eat any of the steak myself. Just because I'm not feeling meat tonight. I'm just kind of, what a vibe out, you know. I do, I do occasionally just decide not to eat meat. So we may be eating some vegetarian streams the next couple streams, just because we might have some just stir fry next stream. Just that might be the play. There we go. Now I'm gonna turn it back up so I can, since I can actually attend to it, put it back down here, and now we're gonna kind of mix this in so it can kind of start to get get up in here. There we go. Get up in here, get up in here. Now I'm going to go ahead and turn it up. A nice, nice bits of mushroom. And I like extra pasta, so I'm going to, that's the reason we got a good pasta to shroom ratio, because I'm going to eat, so I'm going to smash pasta. Pasta. Uh, I'm going to add the rest of my... I think about it, I didn't have before, and then we're, 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 in, we're coasting into the uh, the realm of done. These noodles will be done. Not really going to make anything else too much tonight. This is kind of what we're making. Um, just a tiny bit of little, just a tiny bit of stock. Not enough sauce there for me. There we go. Now it should be turning up. Getting really hot. Now it should get this nice and yeah, now you can see the noodles are starting to turn a little brown because they're actually getting coated in the sauce from the butter and the 
mushroom mushroom sauce. What I might do is I can make this almost like a yeah, that's what I might do. I might add a little thickener to it. We'll see. Might add a little flour to it just to add a th add the thickener. Maybe what is it, cornstarch that does that? I always forget. Let's re consult the internet. Let's consult the let's consult the internet. Uh, what do we need? What do we need? Cornstarch? That's what I thought. I thought it was something like that. Jugtown carrying all over here. Yeah. I knew it was something like that. I just couldn't remember what it was. Couldn't remember exactly what it was. Thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. Well, we've kind of got it's all kind of more a little bit more hot. Let's see if I got some butter and flour. Well, I already have a shit ton of butter in here. Will will would me adding just flour to this work? Just a tiny bit of flour, or would I need to make it a uh, would I need to uh, put it in water first? Time's ticking. No, I'm just kidding. I turned it down. <laughs> what do y'all think? What's up, Jugtown, by the way? How are you? Good to see you. Popping in with just... I love that y'all just pop in sometimes with the culinary, like... You're just like, yes, I need to keep y'all on track. Can I just you? What's up, Pure? Per? Per Blossom? I appreciate you lurking. I always know there's people lurking. I'm not in no hurry. It would be best to coat the flour with the butter before any heat. Okay. Let me see what I got. Let me just make sure I don't lose anymore or anything. I'm pretty sure I got any. I got like pickling salt and all sorts of baking soda. Just the one thing I don't have is cornstarch. Man, that's okay. That's okay. It's okay. Just makes things that I have to pick up on my list. Well, fuck it. You know what we're gonna do? I got this. I'm good. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I got a different idea. You know what we're gonna do? Heavy cream, baby. This will just this will just do the same thing, right? Give us a little more creamy texture. But I gotta make sure the heat's low for this, cause I don't wanna I don't wanna cook the fucking this. And I'm not gonna add a ton of it. I'm just gonna add just a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit, just a tiny bit. So I'm turning it down to make sure, because I don't want to cook this. Because I don't want to make sour cream, basically. I just want to add a little bit of this. I'm going to add just a tiny bit, not a crazy amount. And then I'm going to incorporate it and see where I am. Yeah, oh yeah, we, we, we play around over here, you know? We don't just, we don't just go... Um, Sometimes the traditional route. Sometimes we take the uh, the path less traveled. There we go. There we go. I might need to put a little bit more liquid in here because it's starting to catch to the bottom here. I might have actually cooked a lot of this out. But there we go. Now there we go. That's looking good. Nice, nice and creamy. There we go. Nice and coated. Let's go. You're okay. That's good to hear. It's good to hear. Now I got the heat down. Oh yeah, it smells really good. It smells really good. I think we're gonna I think we're gonna top it off with hmm. What are we gonna top it off with? Thank you, thank you. Uh, I have steak here. There's already steak made. Uh, this is what I did earlier on. So there is some steak. This is all mushrooms. These are these big old honking things. These are mushrooms. I just didn't cook them down a lot because I wanted them still in their kind of full form. So we didn't cook them down. We didn't cook them down in a great a great aspect we just kind of left them more in their whole form here we'll come we'll get a close-up shot time there we go and let me see you can kind of see if we get in close here let's see if we can get in close to this noodle you can actually see like the oh we're too close here let me get y'all cleaned up but uh you can see the actual like the fat on top of this one you can see it kind of uh, all the little bubbles there you don't like steak? Um, I mean, I could see. 
I sometimes don't eat it. All, I sometimes don't eat it all the time, but you know. There we go. And now it's cooked down. Turn it completely off. And I think we're in. Top her off with a little parsley, maybe. No, we're good to go. Maybe a little parsley. No, we'll, we'll be. We'll be by bean. We'll by bean. Let me get a parsley here. Some of the hands. God, I am. I like that there, this, like, this kind of could work. This could work for really shitty weed. Now that I, like, look back at my younger years. This really could work for some, like, shitty weed. It's even got the stems and shit in it. Hit it with a little parsley. Boom. Ooh, woo, hell yeah. Ooh, woo. Ooh, woo, baby. Ooh, freaking woo. Yeah, now we hit it with a parsley. It kind of doesn't translate well on camera because it's kind of not as as bright green as I'd like it, but you know. You love me? <sighs> Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. I see you with the, with the peach looking. Why would that mean? All right, guys. Actually... Fuck this. This is actually now what's for dinner. We're eating these. We're eating cheap Pop-Tarts, baby. Fuck this meal. We're eating cheap Pop-Tarts for dinner. We're eight again. Let's go. Cheap-ass Pop-Tarts. These actually taste fucking terrible, actually. Just to let you know. Never buy these terrible Pop-Tarts. They're like the cheapest brand you can buy. Don't buy them. Yeah, don't do it. Those are delicious, though, when you get the actual their brand. Hey, man, I had to go to the Hood Grocery Store, and that's what they had. And I was stoned and wanted snackies. What do you want me to do? No, you, that, that makes sense. Yeah, no. If you, if you don't like it, I wouldn't. I would say just don't eat it, man. I, um... People bully me all the time about not eating cheese. Bully me all the time, man. Bully me, bully me. It's okay. I'm not American, really. Yet. It's fine. It's fine. I'm American. I'm American. It's okay. Yeah, but, um... Yeah, I don't think that's... It, yeah, if you don't like it, don't eat it. Like, I don't eat cheese a whole lot because I just don't like the way it tastes. Or seafood. People, people fault me on seafood sometimes, and I'm like, eh, just don't like it. You can eat it if you want. I don't mind. You kitties can eat it. Oh yeah, I think that was why my my stomach was upset. This uh, I had to, I had like mega poops, but um, but I think it was from the actual like uh, too much cheese. I think I think it was from the too much cheese. Yeah, tons of cheese. I put a ton of cheese. I. Yeah. My stomach today was freaking wrecked, man. I woke up and I I puked. It was great. My body was like, "Hey, man, um, if you wanna if you wanna go hard on the dairy like that again, we please warn us. We please please warn us." I'm like, "Ah, fuck, man. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I, and I puked. Huh? Makes sense. Uh, yeah. I mean, I may be a little bit. I don't eat. I just don't eat it a lot now in my old older years. Um, I've I kind of given up milk. Uh, I don't know. It's, I mean, the only thing I really drink it in is lattes. Actually, I had a um, I had an ube latte today. Let's see if I can see if I can make this translate onto the camera. Or if I, I'll just share it in Discord. Man, I got so much good food. I'm I'm working on a whole food porn like thing from all the things I've cooked. I need to I need to make more shots like this. Like this right here is pretty fucking cool. It's got like a, it's got good sound and all that. Cracking that bitch open. Uh, anyway, um, let's see. Where's the? Oh, there it is. But yeah, I had this today. It's like pink on the bottom, latte on the top. This is really good. This is really, really good. It tasted like crunch berries, like they said it would. Yeah, I still I still venture on into the into the uh Hey, thanks for stopping by Jugtown. I appreciate you. Have a good rest of your evening. Much love, much love, dude. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, as always.
Where was what at? Where what where was what? What what what? Pizza. The drink? The uh, the drink was made here. Uh uh in a so I love coffee. Um you demand food? Hold on. Here, this is all this is all for you, Zoya. Here. I don't I don't get I'm not eating anything today. This is all for you, okay? It, yeah, I, th I think I posted it into one of the discords. It, it, but it, um, but yeah, I drink a lot of coffee, and um, I, there's a coffee shop here locally that uh, made that. And what it is is ube is a um, purple. It's 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 a potato or a yam, and uh, yeah, it's pretty much it's pretty much beef stroganoff. Yeah, hundred percent. The beef's over here because it's uh it's optional. I forgot that that's the actual name for it. So, yeah. I made beef stroganoff, basically. And I always forget. Because, you know. He's stoned. Um, what's up, Spicy Ginger? How are you? Good to see you. I didn't. I, I kind of I saw a second of that. Because I can only see like four lines of chat at once. So when you guys flood me, I'm like, ah. Bad. I need to, uh, I need to just hook up a monitor to this thing. What? But yeah, what did uh somebody asked me something and I did not remember what it was. What was it that we I was asked? Oh no no I got you on I got you on the drink. The drink was made uh here I I'm, I live in Indianapolis so the drink was made at a place called Commissary. They actually have like an art gallery, um things like that. Uh actually. Per that's something I I would I slowly am working on actually I'm slowly working on that actually um, I've been trying to figure out where a building would be a good building would be I mean I know I can I can write up recipes easy that's not an issue um, but yeah if, if I can find a good enough place I I really do a, my my favorite thing to make is birria or birria or however you want to say it. I don't know how to say it I just make the damn shit um, but that stuff is with tacos with consomme. Um, and it's really good. That's my thing I want to focus on. There's no real good ones in town. I've tried like 15 different places that have it, and no. Uh, I want to start. I want to start an actual. I've been talking to AJ about it actually. Uh, I want to zone. I want to try to zone my um, garage into a commercial um, kitchen. Because all I would have to do is put a bathroom in there, so it would have a place uh, there and have in a point of egress. So I uh, just have to put a door instead of just the garage door. But yeah. Then I just need a three basin sink and whatever I'm gonna cook with, and I'm good to go. And I can do Uber Eats, DoorDash, however many fucking apps there are out these days. So yeah, hundred percent. You want to open? You've always wanted to open your own uh, restaurant, but you don't have time for it. Hey man, maybe I'll have some spots to intern at a you know, you know, curb dog restaurant. I'm gonna use my two people because here's the thing. Correct. Yep. Ghost kitchen. Yep. Correct. Uh, I mean, I'll still have a physical address because uh, I'll show you some later, Wabbit. There's some places in town that actually the restaurant is out of someone's house. It looks like a residence. And what they did was they got the the house that, that they're so they live on a separate uh, or, or in part of the building, but part of the building was zoned as a commercial kitchen, so they can have Uber drivers come up and pick it all up. So they have a legit business. It's there. Uh, it's not being ran out of somebody else's kitchen. It'd be running. It'd be me ran out, out of my own kitchen, so I can minim, so I can help negate costs and things like that. Because out of a ghost kitchen, I ha I get to not. I don't get to see what it is. So like, if I were to do like how Mr. Beast Burger is, Mr. Beast Burger is cooked out of Buca de Beppo, uh, a fucking Italian restaurant. I, uh, you know what I mean. You don't, he he doesn't have control over how they cook the burger. Uh, I would have control over every sing, every single thing that went out the door. That'd be the big advantage because I would have control over every single thing that went out the door. Uh, I'd also be able to make sure it was cooked to my likeness, cooked to the person's likeness. Um, I would always take preference over, you know, what I want because if someone doesn't like something, there's restaurants here in town that actually uh, you can't order any deviance from the menu. Some of the better restaurants in town, you're, you're ordering food from it. It might take a while to get to you, you know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know how. I don't know how. Just like uh, Topo and his chili situation, man. He told me to send him chili and, you know, to get to Cali. I don't know how many days that... I guess I could send it next day. Might be still good. 
by then. Um, you know, I can send it next day, I guess. You know, it's like it's like forty bucks or something, thirty dollars. If we send it U USPS, it might be like twenty. You know, we might we might luck out. But yeah, they do, man. They do. What's up, Britt? How's it going? They want it, man. My 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 weed on legs, man. What's up? You know? My nice nostrils. I remember, you know, I remember things, Britt. I remember things. But thanks for stopping back by, you know. I was wondering if you would show up today, actually. It actually made me laugh so hard. You got a sharp mind? Hell yeah. That's what's up. I love it. I love it. Appreciate it. Wait, how you calling me a kid? I'm probably older than you, son. <laughs> Almost 40. I just got the deceptive looks, buddy. Hell yeah, I appreciate that, Ginger. I appreciate that. Appreciate that. I'm just kind of, I'm just kind of ha hanging here, standing here now, kind of talking, because we're just vibing for a second. Yeah. Yeah. Just kind of chilling, you know. Yeah, I am. I, I am. I'm uh, I'm almost 40, man. I'm 30. I'm 38. Nice. Can, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Highland. That's awesome. How does it... Uh, Tell me that the 30s don't feel any different than the 20s, you know? Tell, just tell me that, okay? Because they won't. You just, you just get better in your 30s, though. The later 30s, you'll be like, God damn, I'm awesome. Yeah, I, I do look young. I just don't have any kids. I don't have any, I don't really have any stress. Um, I go out. I touch grass a lot, so I get this. I get this nice, like, kind of almost tan. Looks kind of cool. Um, it's not really why I go outside, but it makes me kind of shiny. That's all right. We'll take it. Today's kind of a gloomy day, so I'm not going. I'm not gonna. I already went outside today. I did 20 miles on the bike today, so I'm I'm good for. I'm good on that. But yeah, yeah. I'm I'm not I'm not trying to win a beauty contest either. You know. Mid to late thirties. How long's my hair? Hold on, I'll take it out of the the Loch Ness monster trap it's in. Hold on, I'm gonna take it out. It's like shaking the dog off, dude. I played um I played Star like this the other day. Whoa, what the fuck was that? I played Star like this the other day. Actually. Oh god, it's just right in the fucking light. There we go. But yeah. My hair is very long. I'm just going to stay away from the food for a sec. But yeah, this is my hair. This is what it looks like outside. I can become a, uh, I can become a hipster in a, in a moment's notice, you know? Yeah, I'm, I'm chicken style Harry Bacon. Wait, what? Harry Bacon? Let's go. My brain just didn't process any of that. That was good. I love that. Rocking out with electric guitar? No, nah, probably not. Luscious, yes. And it smells amazing. Ah, it smells so good. I use the uh man, man, they should they should uh they should plug me. The honey treasures from fucking um suave. Shit's fucking great. Yeah, I actually had I actually had a dude at a coffee shop one day um walk up to me and go, Harry, and I was like, What? And he's like, Man, you look like Harry Styles. And I was like, What dude? Appreciate it, Per. Appreciate it. You don't want to be thirty, man. Thirty's uh thirty's not too bad. Just um take care of yourself, and you'll and you'll do really well. You know that's what that's what I always say. Watermelon sugar, ha. There you go. You got you now. You got it. Now Anna can go back and get the clip, and she can uh live her fantasies. Um, you know, cause that's her man. You know, but um, yeah, yeah. I've been listening to Ariana Grande recently. Don't uh, don't shame me, but um, that's what that's been my jam. I've just been nonstop repeating that. And a band called um, Antlerhead out of Indianapolis because I got to meet them. I just happened to be um, randomly creeping outside. Out, well, I was walking around and there's a music studio that I know is there. And then I heard music out of it. And I was like, holy shit, I haven't heard music out of this in like three years. And then I just happened to be outside and the owner said, hey, man, do you want to come in and listen? I'm like, fuck yeah. So I met the guy. Yeah, dude. Like, he's the, um, he's the what was that? What was that group back in the day? The Jonas Brothers, the Pure Ring guys? I only remember that because of um. I only remember because of that because because of South Park. I like that I'm like, I'm right up in the cam and uh, you know, it's mostly hair. Now it's a hair stream. Okay, hi. 
What's up? I'm going to talk to you just like this. Even though you can see me in that camera. Well, One Direction of Jonas Brothers? <laughs> That's who it fucking was, yeah. That's who it fucking was. That's who it fucking was. The fucking Jonas Brothers, bro. What the fuck? Hey, man. You've got you've to put some innuendo behind it. How are, how are you going to become a heartthrob, you know? Like... I don't have an I don't have enough innuendo, so I can't become a heartthrob. That's just the way it goes. It's literally the way it goes. I didn't I didn't make the algorithm. Some guy before me made the algorithm. I just have to live with it, okay? Now I'm like, ever since we got a hair in one time in our in the in the food at some point, now I got like PTSD that if I have my hair over anywhere near the food, that it's gonna freaking just it's gonna go in here. Like right now, I just feel like I'm just shaking hair into the food. Like it's a fucking like I'm taking like I'm taking one. Like I'm fucking taking the shaker and just going here's a little hair, you know. But yeah, that's about all I got for today. That's really all I got. Your hair is there. Yeah, same here. Um, how many times do you have to snake the the drain there, Brit? Like how many times do you have to 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 snake the brain there? Snake the brain. Woo, snake the drain. You know, like I've had to do it so many times. Your hair's down to your waist and it gets everywhere monthly. Yeah, I bought it. I bought the tool just to start doing it now. Kind of sucks, actually, because the fucking tub it doesn't drain if I don't do it. So I gotta do it, and it's just like a big old ball of me that comes back up. I'm like, oh, hey, it's me. So, yeah, it's kind of it kind of fucking sucks, but I could go back to being you know, young dapper me, you know, without without it. it I guess maybe I could show you a picture here. Let me see if I have one. I have to go. Way, I have to go way back in time. I have to actually go back in the time machine to find the picture of me with short hair. What do I look like with short hair? I, I don't remember. Where do I have to go? I have to go to like a really old picture. Where is a good picture of me with long, not long hair? Hello? Let's see here. Really? Is that the, all the amount of folder? Okay. Never mind. I'm tripping, I'm tripping. Let's see. Where's a picture of me with short hair? I don't know, man. There we go. There's a lot of short hair, very stone. And a little bit chunkier. Chunky Kirby. Don't mind me. Yeah. It looks like a school picture. Hi. I'm Kirby. You know me. Look at me go. I'm like. I've dropped, you know. I, you know, <laughs> and disappear, disappear. Look at me go. This was a uh, pre-COVID me. Hi, my name's Kirby. How are you today? Can I buy you a drink? All right. I think that's uh I think that's really all I got for today. I really don't have any more commentary. I'm hungry as fuck. I think it's time to eat. We got our we got our food still. Now that I've done we've been talking to about me a million percent. You know, get me to act up. Golfer dad that works at Best Buy, yep. That has two kids that I'm paying child support on also. Yeah. You know it. Actually, I got like nine kids I'm paying child support, and that's why I work at Best Buy, because I don't want them to tax me at all. Got real side hustles on the side. That's okay. No worries. But yeah, this is what we made. Uh, we made steak, too. I just, I'm not going to put it on. Nummy, nummy, nummy steak. I might eat a little bit. We might eat our stroganoff. That's going to be it for me today. I don't know who the hell they'll raid today. So, yeah. You want a nostril cam or something? Here, nostril cam. You'll eat it? Hell yeah. Come on through. And I, we, there's plenty enough. Cake isn't here today. So, we, you know, I always make enough for all three of us to eat. So, try to... Where's the bread? I was I was told today not to make bread because we were having pasta. So, to be fair, I wanted to make bread. But I have bread on the side if I want. I got good old bread on the side. You know what I mean? Victoria's Secret TV. What the hell? What hell, what the hell kind of shit are you gonna get me into? What the hell shit are you gonna get me into? 
I'm going to preview this one. What are you getting me into? Apex? Let me let me see who's on my let me see who's on my peeps real quick. Hold on, I gotta I haven't seen who's streaming, cause I really only watch like a couple people really, really hard. Let me see who's streaming first. Hold on, cause usually I try to rate Zan is yeah I see Zan, I see Ghost Boy, I see Shogun who's not playing his normal game. Yeah. Yeah, I got a Neon Assassin to raid Xan earlier. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. And I know that's where uh, Cake raided, I believe, as well. I think that's where he raided as well. Actually, I'm just going to keep it in the... It, I'm just going to throw it, throw it back to... Uh, let's see, where do I want to go? I still don't know. Yeah, let's go... Um, yeah, he, he did his thing, you know. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna go hit Ghost Boy up. Ghost Boy's a homie. I'm gonna hit Ghost Boy up. He is a homie. I'm gonna go hit Ghost Boy Ghoul up. This my this my dude. I got to I got to play with Tadabine. He's also playing with Tadabine. He's also playing with Dunt Lips. Bunch of great people. So I'm gonna go I'm gonna go raid them. Ghost Boy Ghoul. Probably the probably the second or third time I've raided him in a little while. So you know. But you know, here we go. I'm gonna hit this raid button. I'm out. I'll see y'all later. Y'all have a great night, great day, great everything. I appreciate y'all for being here. Stay wonderful, stay hungry, and uh, yeah, I'll see you where I see you, you know? We all hang out in the same neighborhoods, so peace out. Have a good evening. Oh, I will, Sarah. I will enjoy that food. And uh, yeah, hype Ghost Boy up. He's playing some SAR. Peace.